Live now. Liz, the city is facing some roadblocks. That's right, Carol. The North Side Initiative full of this packet right here is three years in the making and the city says in order to move forward it needs to buy a 105 unit apartment complex. The company that owns the complex will not back down on a price that the city says is way too high. This area we want to build up housing and Bill Barnett is proud to be a key player in the North Side Initiative. Freeman. A plan to transform this area of Spartanburg, a region where 65% of the people live in poverty. We want a healthy neighborhood, um, less crime, more jobs. Part of the initiative is to tear down the Oakview apartments and put a recreation center in its place. Nearby will be a bike trail, early childhood learning center, affordable housing, and fair market housing. They need to have now and redo them. Maybe people feel better about it still. Those living here, like Carrie Suber and her family, want a fresh start for this area. This neighborhood, like this whole strip, house street, is rough. And I feel like if they tear the old buildings down, rebuild the new building, it'll be less crime. But before the city can tear this down, they have to buy it. The price tag on this property is $2.6 million. Barnett says the city believes it's only worth about 600000 the $2.6 million, in our opinion, is not justifiable. Related Properties, which owns the complex, sent us this statement today, which read in part, We have had very preliminary discussions with local officials, and those conversations continue, but we have not seen or been briefed on any such outside appraisal. And based on our history of owning the property for seven years, we dispute that valuation figure. Now, Barnett says unless the city can gain control of the property, they likely won't get a $30 million grant from HUD, which he says they need in order to move forward. Liz Lohheist, WYFF News 